Bye bye. Bye. Thank you so much for flying Thank us. You. What's up, everyone? It's Friday morning. Just landed in New York City LaGuardia Airport. And I've never been to this terminal before, LaGuardia Airport Terminal B, which is the central terminal. I mean, I've been to the old one, but the new one I have not visited yet. It's been completely redeveloped. Luckily, I don't have any luggage to wait for, so just have a laptop bag and my camera bag. But I'm going to go and uh, explore this terminal for the first time. I've done it before pre-security, but since I landed, now I have full uh, access to the uh, terminals where all the airplane gates are. Okay, let's see. What's my first impressions? Okay, this is nice. Very high ceilings. These airlines, they uh, look to be very busy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Well, here's the sign, down the sign. Please step to the side until the section is on the board. It's just as simple as that. Oh my goodness. This is the hassle of airline travel, folks. You get off the plane and you just get dumped into an area where it's so crowded already. But, wow, the new LaGuardia Airport Central Terminal is beautiful. I love this waiting area. Nice lamps. There's uh, red seats. I don't really see any... Uh, hookups for like USB or power outlets though. Okay. I like the artwork they have. Very New York City like. They have the Long Island city gantries, the subway. Looks like that's an R32 car, which is not in service anymore. Um, some of the homes of a local neighborhood in New York City, the Flushing Meadows, Corona Park, Globe. There's the Prospect Park uh, Arch, the Grand Army Plaza Arch, Brooklyn Bridge. Very nice. Nice restroom area. I'm really impressed what they did to the central terminal. I was only get able to see a little bit of it in the pre-security area. Looks like uh, this restaurant's coming soon. Hunt and Fish. I guess this is the main area now. Wow, there's trees in here? Are these real? Yeah, these are real plants. The bark is coming off too. And I love this uh, children's play area. Previously, Terminal B was really run down and outdated. Look at this. They have a Apple Art 
in reference to New York City being the Big Apple. Cafe. And there's another waiting area here. This one has blue seats instead. By the way, the uh, Q70 bus to the subway is now free. You used to have to pay with the Metro card or tap to pay with the device, but now it's free. But most people use, use it to connect to the subway anyway, and that already included a free transfer. So it was kind of uh, unnecessary to be honest, because they got the free transfer anyway. Okay, I guess uh, I guess we have to go upstairs. I like the flow of this escalator. I like the railing too, it's kind of wavy. Let's see, where are we right now? This looks to be an air, airport lounge. Yup, American Admirals Club. You can see the trees peeking out from the top over here. More restrooms and another set of escalators. When we said a whole new LGA, we meant it. And I know New Yorkers, especially people who use the airport often or lived here, had to deal with a lot of delays to get this airport terminal up. Wow, this sky bridge is amazing. Look at this. You could even peer out and see the planes. I do have to uh, add something though. This is just really a visual improvement to the airport, but the actual space that the airlines use, the runways and all the pavement, that really hasn't been improved. I know LaGuardia is notorious for being tricky to land on because there's a lot of uh, infill from like different pieces of metal and it interferes with the airline uh, systems, the airplane systems. I've even heard pilots say that it's like they're landing on an aircraft carrier. I was just going to say it would be nice for them to have a people mover 
or a moving walkway and they have one here but hopefully they could make it the full length soon December. you know what i'm gonna skip this because there's a section over to the right here Doesn't really look like there's much of this space. It's all open. But I do like the artwork they have. Level four shops and restaurants. There's four floors in this post security area. I guess I kind of remember it because when I did the walkthrough of the new LaGuardia Airport pre security before, I noticed there were three floors, but the fourth floor was post security. Ah, uh, yes. We're in the main area now. There's TSA down there. This was the part of the terminal that I missed because I didn't have a ticket to go past security. Okay, I'm super impressed. It looks very modern. The lamps are very like contemporary. And there's a water fountain in the middle. You know, I was looking at the renderings and this water fountain where the food court is, it's supposed to like drip from the ceiling down and be a lot, a lot more grand. Right now it's kind of reduced to a trickle and they even have colors in this fountain too. So I don't know why they have it in this mode right now or maybe it's going to change soon. But I love this area. There's shopping available. Kate Spade, Bowery Bay shops. Oh, wait.
Okay, that was impressive. The line from Dunkin' Donuts is very long. We have to check out this view here. Okay, this is impressive. We saw different patterns, different shapes. I even saw birds in there. Just when you thought it was over, the fountain surprises you with more. Great overview of the airline area. Thank goodness I don't have luggage to claim.
You could spend an entire day just in this airline terminal. Mulberry Streets. Too bad you need an airplane ticket to get to this area. Otherwise, I would go here voluntarily. Once you pass this point, you must continue to exit. And I'm going to postpone my exiting until I completely show off this area. What's up? My first time in this terminal, this is beautiful. Oh, look at this. Everything is a brand new display and modern. They even have uh, car service times, bag claim assignments. My flight from Miami, it didn't show up on the screen yet. probably be here soon I would think maybe not USA Brooklyn diner And this is going to another airline gate. They have a moving walkway up there. And who's gonna do the thing? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> We're like, do we wanna do a radio competition? That would have been fine. Wouldn't that song be? <laughs> Right. I don't think I'm interested in going to another <clears throat> airline gate. So I'll just exit now. Welcome to Terminal B. We hope you enjoy your time with us today, experiencing your exceptional time, shopping, and world class. Here's the Amex Lounge. Centurion.
Yeah, my bad claim assignment for the flight I was on is still not on the screen. Okay, I'm going past the point of no return. Can't come back here. And here is the pre-security area of LaGuardia Terminal B, which I've covered before in a previous video. Okay, so uh, I think I'm going to end my video here. I'm going to call a car service to pick me up. I would take the bus and the subway, but I need to be somewhere and I don't feel like waiting around for public transit. But thank you so much for watching this video of LaGuardia Airport Terminal B. It's glad to be back in New York City after a long time away. Hit that like button, subscribe, and I will see you soon. Bye, everyone. See you next time.